Cancer, let's get going with your weekly reading. This is for March 27th, 2021 to April 3rd, 2021. I've already done my affirmations, prayers, all of that before we started. So let's get going. Spirit, what's the general energy for Cancer going into this week? Energy for cancer. Okay, wow. Right. Exactly four cards. <laughs> we have nine of wands, um, five of pentacles. I mean, sorry, five of wands. Uh, Ace of Cups and Three of Cups and bottom of the deck we have Ace of Swords. All right, so what's going on this week with Cancer? Okay, so I'm seeing that you or your person or someone that you are connected to, your energy is connected to, um, one of you may have uh, hurt the other and, you know, um, someone ended up having to put a, a heavy guard up because of that but there was there was love and some one of you is going to try to come back in it seems this week with um new love it could be new love coming in um wanting to start over wanting to start back over you know um i'm seeing uh get back together kind of like old times or something like that but um one of you may still heavily be heavily guarded so and bottom of the deck, what it, what you don't know, or you know, subconscious, however you read this, um, yeah, you or this person may be wanting to come in with new communication. Um, behind that, we have Page of Swords. You see that, and then the Lovers reversed. Even though I really don't read reversals, but you know that kind of says something. Page of Swords is kind of like. Um, I mean, I'm coming in, uh, I, I want to come in with communication, but it's like um, mind over emotion, like they're just talking to hear themselves speak type of deal. Just want to come back in and see what's going on or something like that is what I'm getting. Um, but let's clarify because I don't know. Let's see. Can you clarify um, what's coming up this week for can Cancer? <laughs> okay, we have Eight of Cups. So yeah, I'm feeling that one of you was heavily, um, had to put their guard up and just decided to kind of walk away from the situation, you know? But there is still love between the two, the two of you. Like there, there was, there was love between the two of you. Whether this be friend or family member, judgment. Mm -hmm. Okay, judgment clarifying the five of wands. So, yeah, someone may have realized that um, they may have passed judgment too early, and. Um, you know, this uh, five of wands to me is kind of like a crabs in a barrel type mentality or someone trying to snuff out someone's, uh, you know, fire. But, um, yeah, it's like this person passed judgment. One of you passed judgment a little bit too early. And, you know, it's, it's really taken a toll on you. And, 
you wanting to come back in. One of you is wanting to come back in. Let's clarify this Ace of Cups. Nine of Wands. Yeah, uh-uh. You or your person is like, no, I'm not coming back in. You're not coming back in. I, it'll, no. The guard is up. Nine of Wands twice. Right here. So I'm kind of feeling like this could be you, Cancer. Um, or no, this could be your person. I don't, I don't know. What did you do, Cancer? Did they hurt you? Did they turn their back on you, um, maybe? And it forced you to have to walk away, but you know, they they could be sensing that you are guarded. This could be a fire sign or someone who has fire, a Sagittarius in their chart. Um, I'm seeing judgment, so that could be Libra too, maybe. Well, let's see, let's clarify this Three of Cups. Is this Cancer or their person that's trying to come back in? Oh, we got two that kind of popped out. Oh, the world. But this one popped out first, the chariot. So yeah, one of you two is going to be trying to come back in to reconcile um, this week, Cancer. So, you know, take it as you will. It seems as though you're pretty heavily guarded or one of you is pretty heavily guarded. So, you know, make sure that um, you are uh, choosing your words wisely. You know, um, maybe one of you might be uh, able to uh, come in with a new form of communication. You know what I mean? And you may be able to hear the other out or maybe the damage is done. Who knows? That, that, that all boils down to, like I say, free will. You know, you do what you do. You don't what you don't. <laughs> and there it is. Um, I could clarify with some runes today. Let's see. Let's dig a little deeper because I'm, I'm being nosy today. What's going on with cancer? Why are they... Um, why do they have their defenses up? What did they do? Like, why, what made them leave and walk away? Mmm. The void room. As I said before, in another video, previous video, the void rune sometimes is like, um, well, one of the meanings is like spirit saying, no, I'm not going to answer you. <laughs> um, another meaning is, um, you know, um, going into the void or, or going within, doing some shadow work, maybe. Um, maybe like one of you had to uh, take a step back from this situation to go inside and do some shadow work and, um, you know, really figure things out for yourself, you know. Um, let's clarify the judgment and the five of wands here. And why were they fighting and... Why were they fighting? Hmm. We've got and Zeus, which is um, one of the meanings is like mouth. So somebody was talking mess, or somebody felt like the other, one or the other was talking about them, and it, it be, seemed like it became a little, a little. That, that's what maybe facilitated all of this whole having to walk away and, you know, maybe something was said about them and someone was judged too harshly. One or the other was judged too harshly. But this person is coming back. This person wants to come back and, and come in for a new beginning with you and, you know, to have to have the love that they had with their cancer before, maybe. Or you could be longing for and thinking about this person and what, and thinking maybe you should go back and try for a, another um, chance. Maybe watch some of the, you know, be a little cross watcher on some of the other signs and <laughs> you'll see whether or not you should go in and <laughs> take that chance. 
So the Nine of Wands and the Ace of Cups, uh, whether you should, I asked them um, in my head uh, if you should, uh, if one or the other, if you two should break down these walls, should break down these barriers and possibly let this person in. And the room that came out was this. Canu. And that means torch. Sound like somebody want to fight fire with fire. You know? Or it could be the energy of the wands. You know, someone coming in to, you know, very uh, hastily or wanting to, you know, just... Um, Oh, with like that fiery spirit, that <laughs> passion, that passion for their cancer or wanting to start just to begin again, coming in passionately to begin again. But um, <laughs> another meaning for this is ulcer. So, you know, they... <laughs> That maybe this person has been um, experiencing or you may have been experiencing uh, someone uh, energy that I'm picking up on. Maybe experiencing some sort of uh, stomach pains. So, you know, it, and it's like, you know, literally making this person sick or making you sick that you two can't be together. And it's like one or the other can't take it anymore. And they're like, I just want to come in for, and, and talk and begin again with the cancer or you with the other this week. So, wow. The clarifier for the chariot and three of cups of coming in and, and bringing everything together. Will this happen? Will this be the outcome? And we received this room. Hagal. Hmm. That's like, um, Whew. Havoc. <laughs> That's why I'm so hesitant to say it. Havoc. Um, I don't know. Is, is this person coming back in to wreak havoc in the life? Or are they coming back in to apologize and, and start again? Um, because they know that they have uh, or what they've done. Um, to make you walk away or what you've done to make them walk away has been wreaking havoc on them and they're just ready to come back in and and, and make things right you know um, they may have been having some tower moments and you know they want to begin again the world you know means to begin again that's the last of the major arcana and it's to begin a new cycle ending an old cycle and beginning a new cycle they want to put this behind them or you may want to put this behind you so that's uh that's what's going on this upcoming week for you guys cancer um wow that's heavy Ooh, good luck 